finds a pass. Solskjaer. Yo, roommates here, and welcome to a FIFA 23 Ultimate Team Player Review for both 89 rated Solskjaer and 90 rated Xavi. Two of the cheaper options of Trophy Titans Team 2. I thought, why not try them out? They look interesting. So, Solskjaer stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, has the average body type, high medium work rates, he's right foot with a 4 star weak foot, and 5 star skill moves. Looking forward to trying those out. So, I bought him for under 35k ridiculous price really he can play striker or center forward he's a hero which means he automatically gets three chem points premier league get two his nation gets one so i stuck a hunter on him makes him the controlled accelerate type his pace and shooting look amazing his passing it looks okay his dribbling we'll see how the 80 balance and 83 agility do the rest look really good his heading is okay except for his jumping his stamina he will get tired towards the end of the game and his strength and aggression are a little bit low brief hero profile he's only got the team player trait that's a bit disappointing and let's go on to 90 rated Xavi who stands 5 feet 7 inches tall has high high work rates he's got a short and lean minus body type his preferred foot is his right and he's got a three star weak foot not the best and four star skill moves he's coming in at under 45k again another ridiculous price he can only play center mid he's an icon which means his nation of spain get two chem points he automatically gets three i've stuck a shadow on him makes him the explosive accelerate type his pace should be okay around the 90 mark his shooting i guess it's okay again for a central midfielder here's where the card really excels his passing and dribbling look excellent looking forward to trying those out his defending not the greatest i would suggest pairing him with someone more defensive minded but i mean it's okay i guess and his physicals not the greatest either his stamina though he'll last all of the game brief icon profile he's got a playmaker outside foot shot and team player traits i'll be playing him in the cdm position next to pogba and solskjaer in the striker position just going to show you the instructions so solskjaer balance with mixed attack normal inceptions basic defense support xavi balance defense balance attack normal inceptions cover center and stick to position i'm going to stick them into division rivals and let's see how they play it's a nice team Quite agile. Wow, did really well to keep the ball there. Finds a pass. Solskjaer. That is a lovely finesse into the top right corner. Not even timed. 1-0. If you're enjoying this review so far, please hit the like button. It will be greatly appreciated. Thank you. Interception there. Ooh, unlucky there. Wow, Xavi did well there. Ooh, unlucky Solskjaer with a short corner kick. Oh, Xavi, what a tackle, mate. I thought that was one of my centre backs. Nice little movement and pass there. Interesting pass. Oh, a bit of a loose touch. He's not going to out-muscle in Kimpembe, but he's won the ball back. Did really well. Wow, really good teamwork then from Solskjaer and Xavi. And we found ourselves 2 0 up before half-time. Damn, caught out. Oh, Solskjaer's shot almost went under Edison. Unlucky there. Carried forward by Zabi. Intercepted. Interception. Oh, beautiful pass. Oh, Solskjaer on the turn. That's disgusting. Oh, this... Oh, Red timed it and it's flown in. Wow, Zabi. Well done, mate. <laughs> Intentional. Oh, Solskjaer with the flare shot. Unlucky. Great tackle, honestly. Ah, poor pass. That's my bad, though. <laughs> Lovely. Oh, pass as well. Pedro. 
Time shot in the back of the net. Lovely pass to him by Xavi. I mean, 45k. Wow. That cheap, really. Oh, lovely turn by Solskjaer. A bit of lag there. Oh, see you later, mate. Oh, I've red timed it. <laughs> My bad. He red timed it too. <laughs> ah, they get the lucky break there. Good positioning. Took in a stride there. Just shrugged off though. That's a lovely turn. Oh, timed effort. Just not too... Not enough to the right, really. Corner. <laughs> Almost caught him out. Deep into Fergie time there. Full time. Damn. Okay. <laughs> I got done there. Oh, destroyed by Lucio. Oh, that was too easy for them. Oh, I thought I was going to make space in the box with Xavi there. Nice little pass. Nice change of direction. Oh, I can't make the space. You know them players that absolutely bore you to death and then you're just going to concede because you don't concentrate. Yeah, this is one of them. <laughs> You know what? Honestly, I'm just not concentrating because he's so boring and he's going to gritty me. I'm half asleep here. I'm going to go all out attack literally just to win the ball to kick out and leave because I am bored to death. Here we go. Honestly, how boring can you be? Hey, disconnected. I disconnected. <laughs> wow, Red Messi. Neat footwork there. Oh, honestly, I can't deal with a player across the box like that. <laughs> that was a decent ball through by Solskjaer. Tipped round the post. Oh, unlucky again. Ah, decent finesse shot with some lag added to it, but saved easily. Ah, oh, again parried. Courtois. Bruh. Oh my gosh, I made him do a backflip. Oh! <laughs> Solskjaer with the tapping. Capitalised on... I don't even know what he capitalised on. Solskjaer feels pretty good on the ball, I have to say. I don't think he needs to boost his dribbling. I don't know what happened to my defence there. It's always straight after half time. Nice acceleration. Can he get away here? They tried to trip him up. Oh, move your keeper, mate. I saw that a mile off. <laughs> Great interception there. Good pass as well. Oh, unlucky there on the break. Oh, nice interception again. I oh, lose the ball, unlucky. Nice passes. And again. Oh, Solskjaer, is he in? Ah, oh, I wanted him to move his keeper again. Oh, that was a nice pass. Ref. I made space and finished it in the 85th minute. Might be the winner. That is great work. Get the W. So after three games, I know it says four, but we left one really early. We got five goals, one assist. That is a pretty good return in Division 1 rivals. What do I think of Solskjaer? Well, I mean, 
value 10 out of 10 35k this card he performs quite well in game i'm quite surprised i'll go through the pros his pace he definitely has enough pace with the hunter he actually got away from the defense one time and scored so yeah quite impressive his pace i think the hunter is the correct chem style for him i don't think you actually need to boost his dribbling that's my next pro his dribbling feels pretty good, I have to say, he feels quite smooth turning. He's obviously not the most responsive player in the world, however, he's definitely responsive enough. I wasn't having the best gameplay, and he was definitely still usable. Of course, the 5 star skill moves, he performs them pretty well actually, so definitely a bonus. His shooting, on point, I mean, a great ratio there, it was 5 goals in 3 games. So yeah, very good shooting, and his passing, not the best, keep it simple and you'll be okay. Cons, physicals, he's not blessed. Physically, strength aggression low, stamina not the greatest, okay heading. So yeah, physical is a con. Performance, 8.5 out of 10. I think he's pretty good and value definitely 10 out of 10. I mean, basically for the price, you've got this great design, five star skills, dynamic image. What more can you ask for for 35k? By the way, if you're enjoying this review, why don't you hit the subscribe button? I'll be releasing a lot more FIFA 23 player reviews and content. But let's move on to Xavi. What do I think of him? Well, again, it's a 10 out of 10 for value. 45k for this card is ridiculous, honestly. And the performance, I think it's at the same sort of level as Solskjaer. They're both pretty good, actually. Very capable, even in Division 1 rivals. I'm going to go through the pros of Xavi. His dribbling is immense. He's very responsive in game, turns really quickly. If you like R1 or RB dribbling, this is your guy. His passing, also immense. Had no issues with his passing. Not many misplaced, if any. Very accurate. You can put the power on them, play them in. Honestly, his passing is excellent. His pace, I've put an asterisk there. It's nothing amazing, but he has enough pace with the shadow for the center of midfield, I think. His defending, again, not amazing. Do not have this guy as your lone CDM. That would be crazy. Pair him with someone more defensive, more physical, or I think his best position would actually be in a box-to-box -box role. Use him like that. And his shooting. I mean, two goals in three games. That's not too bad from the CDM position in a 4-2-3-1. Cons, physicals. He's not the most blessed physically. I mean, his strength and aggression, rubbish. Heading, rubbish. Five foot seven. He's not winning any headers, really. Stamina lasts all the game. But yeah, physicals, definitely a con. And obviously, that three-star weak foot isn't great. But again... 8.5 out of 10 for the performance, 10 out of 10 for value, definitely worth the 45k. If you pack this guy, why don't you try him out? You might be surprised. But again, this has only been my opinion. Please like, subscribe and comment if you appreciated it. Take care.